Okay, here we are with Ryan Podunk Harris. What's up, y'all? <laughs> About to shape his 10 model. 2010 signature model called the, the 10. <laughs> a lot of things come to mind when I think of the number 10. It's a new decade and, uh, you know, perfect 10, perfect wave, perfection. So, uh, basically what I'm doing on this model is... Uh, trying to fit everything I know, trying to cram everything I know about surfboard design into as small a package as possible. Um, I really listen to a lot of what Kelly Slater says and he seems to be going shorter and wider and so I kind of just took that to an extreme. Uh, basically this, this model will be ridden anywhere from about 8 to 12 inches shorter than your regular um, go-to shortboard. And, um, about an inch wider and uh, just about an eighth of an inch thicker and uh, it doesn't give up any performance it's still a very high performance board there's going to be a lot of uh, nose rocker hidden in it I mean at first glance it's wide it's beefy so it looks like more like a fish more like a performance fish but it's not uh, it's got modern concave and uh, just a lot of float compared to what you're used to I tried one a couple weeks ago and pretty good surf about a foot overhead and was getting in early and making every single drop and just having a blast. So this is what I've come up with and we're just going to take a couple measurements and plot out the lines on here so you can see what I'm talking about. It's got a big fat diamond tail, put all five pins in there and it's just a super fun board. So uh, yeah, we have the 10 or we'll workout uh, for a 5.3. Uh, so this is probably going to be one of the more popular sizes of 5.3 which would be, you know, average rippers are probably having about 6.0, 6.1 regular shortboard. And this is, uh, you know, 5.3 is about in that ballpark of 8 to 10 inches smaller. So, you know what, my top That's secret. It. This top secret right here, my baby. That is uh, the 10 template. Right there. Real wide to ill. 11 inches. <laughs> Eco-friendly resin. So this is going to be a green product. 